guys. I'm fixing something for lunch and I thought you might like to join me. We haven't cooked together for a while. To be honest, I haven't been doing much cooking. My weight will reflect that. <laughs> anyway, today I'm making a vegan quesadilla. No queso involved. So what I did to start, well, let's start with ingredients before I tell you what I did. So cook some potatoes in your Instant Pot. Just cube them up and cook them so that they're uh, nice and soft. I leave the skins on just for health benefits, but you can do whatever you like. If you want to peel them, go ahead. You'll need some beans, chili seasoned beans. Now, I always cook my beans up ahead of time and keep them in these jars. You know that if you followed me for a while. If you don't have seasoned chili beans, you can use canned. Um, some salsa, hot or mild, make it yourself, use it prepackaged, whatever you like. Then you're going to want your spices, which I always use this basically the same ones because that's what I like. Some onion powder, some garlic powder, some paprika, and some nutritional yeast. No, this isn't the brand that I use. Um, I use a much better brand, but I keep this container from when I first started eating plant-based, and I just keep refilling it with the bags that I buy. And then you're gonna want some um, flour tortillas. Um, I've already got my pan hot and my potatoes are hot. So what you're gonna do is take your potatoes and add your seasoning. And I'm adding some onion powder. Sorry, let me switch you down here. So you can kind of see what I'm doing. Let's move things around. There we go. I haven't done this for a while, you guys. I know you complain that I, I don't cook enough. And um, I don't have anyone to cook for anymore. It's just me. Adding the paprika. And then I'm going to add the nutritional yeast. And basically what that does is adds your chili, I mean, sorry, your cheesy flavor. And I know you're going to ask me how much. Well, that depends on how, much, how many potatoes you're doing. That's probably two good sized potatoes. And that's probably about a quarter cup. Um, then I'm going to mash. And just mash them up really good. This is going to be your filling for your quesadilla. You all knew that queso means cheese, right? Queso, quesadilla. So basically what that means is... Cheesy tortilla. Then I'm going to take my beans, and that's still got the juice in there. And then add some beans. Mix it up real good. I won't know how much I want to put in there until I mix it. Let's see. Yeah, some more. So about a can. About a can of beans and um, about two medium potatoes. How's that? And then smush those beans as well. Now, because we're smushing the beans, that means if you want to use a vegan refried bean, you can use that. And then that is the filling for the quesadilla. And that's what it looks like. So, like I said, I've already got my pan really hot. And my pan isn't hot, my stove is hot. So I'm gonna put the pan on there. And then take our tortilla, and I'm hoping that all this can be seen on the camera. And then take your filling, 
and put it on half of the tortilla. Okay, like so. And then I'm going to take some of this salsa and put it on half, put, put about half of it on the mixture. And then the rest is to dip the quesadilla in after it's finished. Okay, then fold it over. That's why we only put it on half. Fold it over and let it get nice and brown on both sides. And that's a small burner, so that might take a little while. And I'll show you what it looks like when it's all finished. I don't want the video to go too long because you all won't watch it. But it's nice to see you again. I hope you've enjoyed seeing me again. And um, let's do this more often, shall we? Have a great day.